Welcome to Cadence Design Systems Fidelity Tutorial Tuesday, where we show you how to use our fully integrated environment Fidelity in short videos of a few minutes. Today we'll discuss how to extrude a volume mesh with anisotropy using the Simple Sweep feature of Fidelity. The Simple Sweep feature extends a surface mesh patch along a given direction to enlarge the volume mesh compared to the initial geometry. This can be useful to create extruded meshes for volutes, inlet pipes and ducts. We start with a previously generated volume mesh using the surface to volume method of Fidelity Hexpress. Our goal here is to generate another mesh that includes an extension of half a meter for this centrifugal compressor volute outlet pipe. By selecting the outlet boundary, we can activate the simple sweep feature. In the local tab, the inputs are the number of cell layers to be created in the given direction, the cell expansion ratio between each layer, the mode to propagate the layers, we can specify the first cell size in the direction of the swept mesh or the total distance of the swept mesh part. Next we have the direction of the mesh sweep, which can be user-defined with a Cartesian axis, following boundary normals of each cell face of the patch, or following the average boundary normal of all cells of this patch. We usually recommend using the Cartesian axis options just to avoid small local normal deviations which can affect large swept meshes. After launching this setup, the result is an unstructured volume mesh with anisotropy in the outlet pipe which was generated in 20 minutes on 8 cores on my laptop. The inclusion of the swept part allows me to investigate a new design without having to modify the original CAD file that I started the project with. Thank you for watching! If you liked this video, be sure to click the thumbs up button to subscribe to our channel for more upcoming content like this. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, please drop us a line down below or connect with us on LinkedIn, which is linked in the description. Thank you all and have a great Tuesday!